Want to hear about the shit I learned in college? <laughs> Penguins are dinosaurs. Walt Whitman must have had sex with Oscar Wilde. You could bite off your own thumb as easily as you could bite a carrot in half. When you start a sentence with a dependence clause or an independent phrase that has more than three words, add a comma. Yeah. That one might actually be useful. I learned how to ride a skateboard, how to do a proper push-up, how to go to bed at three and wake up at seven, time to finish an essay that's due at noon, how to loosen up my shoulders. I learned that if you wholly and unironically love bands that sound like Evanescence, your roommate will say you're corny and uncultured and for the love of God, turn off that murder music. I learned that life is slightly more difficult when you still use a flip phone because you can't text and no one remembers how to make phone calls on their phones. That the average friendship doesn't last more than seven years and that sometimes your friends will suddenly stop talking to you. But that's not your problem and yes, they are just as insecure as you. <laughs> I learned that most people will not watch Black Mirror with you on a Friday night when there are ample opportunities for alcohol and weed. I learned how much I hate alcohol and weed. <laughs> how much I hate hearing frat boys drink their way through the weekend while I'm drowning in essays. How much I hate talking to stoners who are like, so high, <laughs> when they're supposed to be helping me study for midterm. How much I hate watching half-naked, glitter-clad girls do a lap dance on top of someone that they met at the party 15 minutes ago. I learned how to shout into a microphone. I learned that the only thing about college I hate more than parties is Tinder. <laughs> Though I still check the app on my iTouch when I want to be reminded of all the women I can't date. <laughs> that even though Carl's Jr. ads and their excessive bikinis disgust me, they still kind of turn me on. <laughs> and that this was normal for a 21-year-old boy. That when I'm a 120-pound Asian dude who doesn't need to shave more than twice a month, then the word sexy doesn't apply to me that I will often feel like the only one in the room who is still a virgin, that the girl will never come up and talk to me first, and that this too is normal. I learned Audre Lorde, your silence will not protect you. But I also learned that you should not start talking to a cute girl merely for the nearly non-existent chance that she will fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, Jason, remember that profanity in your head, and fuck you, Jason, bring profanity in this poem. This was supposed to be family friendly. I learned that I'm not the only one terrified by the sudden urge to jump off a balcony or push a toddler into traffic or scream profanity at my professor in the middle of lecture or bite off my own thumb right before your eyes. They're called intrusive thoughts and that it is normal to feel abnormal. I learned that I would not take a bullet from my best friend or even sacrifice the Evanescence albums on my eye touch to save the world. However, I learned that I don't mind guzzling a bottle of bacon-flavored soda or wearing a dunce cap on campus for 48 hours straight or dropping a class halfway through the quarter to finish a 50,000-word manuscript for National Novel Writing Month or being that one guy who won't shut up about Poets Club. Thursdays, 7 p.m., South Hall 2617. I learned that I'm weird. But if there's ever been such a thing as a normal college student, then that guy didn't learn shit. <laughs> <laughs>